Welcome to a new Let's Play with some of our mistakes. for the cattle, they are short of eight. And then we are going to head over, we've got the one ten ninety I think it is we've got we've got that it's there under the upper we're going to sell some crops. It is running, we're warming it up so we've got something warm to sit in when we go over. These have got plenty of total mixed ration and stuff but they're just short of a bit of A so there they are. They needed all that bale. We will take this, put it back in the shed and uh, Get our sword. Ooh. Oh, tank over. Don't use it. Don't want to damage the spikes on our bale. Spike. <coughs> Get this book back in the shed for the day. We have been and sorted the sheep out. We've done everything else for the animals needed to do. Little Massey there. Not doing a lot anymore. And we shall get aboard here. Let's just have a look. Oh, no, that's not the right button. Want to have a look. The wheat's on the up, everything else. Oats are going down in price, so I think we'll sell that wheat at Ad Millen Merchants, which are. Let's have a look and see where we've got to go to for those. Admiral and Merchants, yeah, not far away from the, not far away from the farm actually. Yeah, we will fill our trailer with wheat. <coughs> Grandfather's somewhere turning it on. Oh, I have we got cheat on this? We have indeed, we'll get it cheated. We shall nip down to add million stores. So I've got a sat nav on well, my mobile phone with the ma Google Maps on it to make sure we're going in the right direction. It's going to be tricky with this, a lot of weight and very slippery, so we've got to be careful. Now we drive, especially when we're on the back roads and farm tracks. We may get a couple of loads sold, which will boost our money up nicely. I'm not sure whether that crop came through before the winter set in, before we got the snow, but Oh. We are 
that way, a car that way. There we go. This tractor really does struggle on the hills with this trailer, but and to the bottom of here and turn to the left again, we will put the phone away. We know where we're going now. Trailer a little bit too big for the tractor, really, but it is what it is. Look for a green arrow telling us we're there now. Somewhere within the vicinity of it. Yeah. Yeah, it's over here. That's it. We found it. Over the bridge. There again we struggle at Mill and Village. Here's where we've got to be careful now. Slow ourselves down a bit because they haven't cleared their yard. Already feeling the tractor slip under us. Here is where we are heading. Lovely. <coughs> and sell our first crops. Out of the grain door, Pretty good. Um, some farms, well, most farms used to put an SCN sack on the back of those truck doors and bag their grain up, store it in bags. We got 9,414 for that load. Happy with that, takes our bank balance now to 17,000, so a little bit less skint now. Let's go and ride around here and find a bit of a timber boat that's around the back here. Wend our way back to the farm and get another load of wheat, I think. And bring it here. New cars coming, okay to go. Goodbye for now to Admiral, and we will be back soon. Advert there for the ferry service that runs. There is a few fields where farmers have to go over the water on the ferry. I know Grandpa started off there, he owned them, but he has since sold them. We're now head up to Baladon where we live. By the way, if you're worried about me with not having windows and doors on my house and a tent inside it, I while we've got this snow and cold weather, I'm staying with my grandfather across the road from the farm. So I'm nice and snug when I'm in bed. faster down here but with not knowing whether the roads have got any black ice on them. Just wait for this car to lava to chop the corner. He's taking his time the same as we are. Which is good to see. And we are back home. <coughs> and 
Ah, nice house. We will, we will be back in the spring. Yeah, it's been quite. What's different sleeping in a in an house in inside a tent? Never thought growing up that I would be living in a tent inside of an house. I used to love playing tents when I was younger. We should back under another load of wheat. Weather forecast looking little clout oh, it's gone a bit too far there too far over that's looking better see it is so we've got a good amount of wheat off these fields what we've got so hopefully by the end of winter we should have a good bit of land a uh, good bit of money to buy some more land and whatever else we need. We have also, I uh, wouldn't get back, we better check where we're going to sell the milk and take a load of milk. Don't want it going sour in our tanks. So it traps are not stopping too quickly on the farm track. This tractor since we've had it been pretty good. We started out with a Massey Ferguson 65 and a 135 and a Grey Fergie. Now we've got three Fiat's on the bar. What tractors we will have on here going forward I haven't got a clue. Certainly these tractors aren't going to be enough if we do expand a good bit. Grandfather didn't own all the land in this area, but that main Balladorn farm he did did own that. That's fine, that's good. All my stuff from the house over at the farm, it's all gone over to grandfather's. Don't want anybody, because we can't lock it up, don't want people going in and taking advantage and pinching it. Here we are back at Adraline. See, grain merchants. I'm not going to sell any more wheat today, otherwise the bottom will drop out of the market. Right, we should give it up. The guy who runs the place will lift the shoot up for us. Let's see how close to what we had last time we are for this load of grain. Probably won't get as much, but Hopefully we do. Almost empty now. In fact we've got a bit more for that. It's still going up in price. Which is surprising. But, even though that's still going up in price, we still need to sell some milk before it goes off. We'll be heading to the dairy every day whether we've got a full tanker or not because we don't want to have any sour milk in the tank otherwise that means taking the lid off, climbing in, scrubbing it out and well, 
horrible job. Remember once grandfather had it when the milk trucks and everything were on strike. It was an horrible job cleaning the tank out of sour milk. Absolutely smelly. And you're in a confined space with just the service hatch at the top. There's ventilation. want to avoid a situation where we get sour milk. We'll find out where the milk is sold and get it taken over. this under cover although pack it under the opera and put a sheet on it it will be fine should be fine fingers crossed we'll probably be selling some more crops tomorrow We've got 27,000 at the moment. We have got the milk to come in as well today. We'll back this under the upper ready for tomorrow. I don't think we're going to get any more snow and we've got the sheet on anyway so it should be oh, I would say it'd be fine I'm going to risk it for a biscuit come a little bit of a weird angle at that we need to get on the property there we are it's better We shall drop that there. Oh. Installed the tractor. We shall look up to the milk tanker. Not sure how much we'll get for the milk, but no matter on price, it has to be sold. And if they gave you a pound for a thousand litres, a pound is less plus the diesel to take it. Uh, a lot better than going in there cleaning out sour milk. Right, so where do we sell the milk? Where do we sell the milk? Who buys milk? Well, they had mill and dairy. So back to hard mill and we go. You'll soon know this area like the back of your hand following us around we shall take this so that and that is where we will leave you for today downside to having cows is this job has to be done pretty regularly. <coughs> Could manage a couple of days before the milk needs to come up here but uh, Sunshine. Where is 
garden really down. That's what we've got to find now. Let's just pull to the side of the road. I think I'll tumble down out there. Let's just check where. Mark Mellon Dairy is. Now a little bit further down to where we was. Lovely. Let's go again. <coughs> Wasn't 100% sure where they put it. We've got to go through Mark Mellon Village. Stores there. Not hard mill and stores. We're probably in a couple of days' time. And here's hard mill and dairy. Lovely job. Probably in a couple of days' time. Hard mill and stores. We'll have a pint or two of our milk in it. Where do you take? Go around here it says, got the arrows pointing around, so uh, yeah, here's where we're going. So right, those pallets and port lift have been there a day or two. Farm milk, what other milk are they going to be giving us? <coughs> So we didn't check on the price for the milk before we come. Got 4,669 4, for that. But as I say, no matter what the price is, the milk has to be sold. It's not something you can hang on to for a, a price hike at any point. Thirty-one thousand seven hundred fifty-eight pounds on the farm now. Uh, as we head back to the farm, thank you, everybody. Hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Please give it a like, give it a share, drop us a comment if you're new. To the Summer Farm Estates channel, please, and you'd like to see more of what we do, please subscribe to the channel. Give that bell a ring, it will tell you when the content is uploaded, be it farming simulator or iRacing. Until you join us next time, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe, enjoy your day, and goodbye for now.